At the Yucca Flats Proving Grounds in Nevada, a plastic balloon carries aloft the largest atom bomb ever to be tested in the United States. As H hour approaches, heavy sunglasses are donned, not only by the engineers in charge of the test, but also by newsmen and cameramen. The seconds tick away. Five, four, three, two, one. It's an awesome display of nuclear might. Trees burst into flames five miles away. Windows rattle 300 miles away in California 20 minutes after the blast. An airline pilot a thousand miles away saw the flash. Marines huddled in trenches three miles from ground zero came through unscathed and then plunged through a vast cloud of dust in an attack on Central Station is a big place, accustomed to big crowds, but the arrival of an Army Redstone missile really has usually stayed commuters gaping in amazement. The five-ton rocket presents a challenge to engineers and workmen who stand here on end, and a breathtaking display of mechanical ingenuity to travelers in the station. The exhibit is a salute to the International Geophysical Year, and to commuters who miss their train, what a way to get home. Why, you could blast off and be home in no time. Flat. 